coming up on Rookie Chops. We got five minutes! Come on. Oh, yeah. I don't want it on my food, man. Did you really burn those? It's about the technique, the presentation. Uh, man, everyone knows you don't flip the steak. Here we go, here we go. Now you got to have the meat cooked right. Hey, hey, hey. Wrap it up! Five, four, three, two, one. Hands up! All right, gentlemen, real quick. Hopefully you guys got some good game planning going, ready to go, ready to attack it, right? All right, so we're now gonna take five minutes. You're gonna collaborate with your chef, figure out what you guys wanna do. He'll give you some direction. You literally have 45 minutes to cook everything and then present it to the judges. So it's gonna be one display plate, three tasting plates, all right, for the three judges. You have a plethora of different items to choose from. Your chefs will go over and give you a little bit more insight about what's going on, what it is. Do you guys have any questions, all right? These rookies are broken down into four teams of four. Each team is paired with an Aramark chef who will assist them with planning, preparing, and plating their dish all in under 45 minutes. Just looking out for the uh, technique and you know, just something different, you know, trying to see what kind of ethnicity they're going to put into the food, you know, I just want to see what the, the flavors they're going to bring to the plate, you know, it's challenge my palate. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go have a look. Hola, boys. What's up, what's up? What's going on, what are you guys cooking? Hey man, just a little steak, a little steak, a little quinoa. A little quinoa. Hey, what's your protein? Tenderloin. Tenderloin. What do we got? Sandwich. Steak sandwich? Yeah, with some country style potatoes on the side. Okay. Okay. That's some more a bit on, on the unhealthy side, but I like that, I like that. <laughs> JJ, what you know about seasoning, man? What you know about seasoning? I'm Spanish, man. I got it in my blood. <laughs> we got cooking. We have a little risotto right here. We have a little stuffed filet. Risotto? Stuffed filet. Right. Stuff oh my God. It's Andre Dillard. What are we going cooking today? What's your protein? Top secret, man. We got Top secret? What do you know about seasoning, man? Right here. <laughs> That's nice. That's nice. I like that. I like a little bit of technique there. Wow, so you got cooking, man. What are you, Over here, man. What are you doing? What's that? Potatoes. <sighs> smells nice. A little rosemary in there. I like that. I like that. I like that. I like that. All right. So we just went around and we saw all the rookies, what they're doing. Looks a bit okay, but I think it's time to apply the pressure and bring it to them. Let's go stick it to them. Huh. Let's go stick it to them. Who said, who allowed this asparagus on the grill? I hate asparagus, it's the worst. Oh no. That's un unacceptable, the way you're seasoning. Bring it up, yeah, you don't know what you're talking about. What are you doing? So what happened is, you know, we're gonna put it in a sandwich. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I was gonna get it, well, bite into it, boom. Yo, great. Little surprise, mid bite, easy to. That's one of the things I've been looking at today, watching teams one, two, three, and four. But then again, I looked at uh, team four here. They, they're really marinating a lot of that meat and stuff. And it looks like they're cooking pretty good. Team four, I think, is doing a great job. They're infusing some potatoes, marinating the steaks really well. It looks amazing, smells great. Again, team two, you yes. know, they're charring some uh, tomatoes, probably a little sauce going there, so it looks really good. Man. Flipping the steak too many times. He's, he's flipped the steak too many times. No, oh, man, everyone knows you don't flip the steak. Clayton, you know that. You know that you let your teammate butcher it. Team two, you can see they're definitely inexperienced there. Flip the steak one too many times. One, two, three, four, five, six, maybe eight times. I was standing there just watching it being butchered alive. You know, but what do I know? I'm not a chef. Here we go, here we go. I'm gonna close it out now. We got five minutes! Come on, dog. It's beautiful. This is the technique I'm talking about. We're getting cheesesteak sandwiches at the back. Getting burnt veggies on the other side. This is what I'm talking about. Ah, I don't want it on my food, man. So we got the fire and stay Here we go, here we go. Wrap it up. Five, four, three, two, one. Get up! The 
your teams present their creations to our savvy veteran judging panel. They describe each intricate detail of the dish, each group trying to make their pitch for who should be crowned this year's Rookie Chop Champion. Yeah, I'm not Checking if it's a well done or medium rare. After sampling each plate, the judges deliberate and make their decision on which team will take home the title. Oh, this one's a tough one. Fourth place. Team one. Oh. Third place. Team two. Oh. 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 So we just finished this year's 2019 Chopped and we have our winners team through. We have Ryan Bates from here, here from team three. Ryan, why don't you just tell us what you guys cooked today and why you guys won? You no, know, we wanted to, you know, we wanted to separate ourselves from the rest of the pack. You know, we had stuffed filet mignon along with nice roasted garlic PM Ocean sauce and a nice risotto creme fraiche. We wanted to stand out from the pack and, uh, you know, I think we did. It was great. Everything married up together and what a way to, to close out this year's CHOP 2019. We'll be back next year and here are your winners again. Team 3, I'm with Ryan Bakes. <laughs>